Hello, it's Miss Lawrence. Are you ready for today's art lesson? Because you are in for a treat. We are going to be drawing my taxidermy squirrel with top hat. All right, so get your pencil, your eraser, and your paper ready. All right, so I'm going to start with the body shape, which is kind of a long oval. Kind of more like a bean shape. All right, we're going to add his oval head. So we're going to start that one right here. And the tail curls around. And no, <laughs> get down. <laughs> we have a foot. Here's one, two, three toes. His other foot you can kind of see back here. One, two, three toes. He's on a, we're going to put him on the log last. All right, here's his other foot. One, two, three. And this one I can't see, so we're going to leave that one out for now. But I am going to put this log. So he's standing on the log. There we go. Make it kind of log like there. And all right, I now need to add the top hat. I'm going to get my eraser out. I'm going to erase where the neck connects and the tail and the foot. And we're going to shade and I'll shade in the hat black. You can use colored pencils or crayons or even markers if you want to. I'm just going to do a little shading with the pencil here. Okay. I need to add his ear, which I can kind of see a little bit. His eye. He's got a nice almond shaped eye. Nose. Smile. All right, if I look down, I can kind of see his other foot, so I'm gonna draw that one there. And now I wanna erase, right, my eraser, where it connects over here. I wanna draw this one back in. Okay, and he's got fur, so I'm going to add, I'm gonna use my pencil to shade him in, and I'm gonna make little strokes to add all the fur. You could do this with a colored pencil, with, he's kind of brown, kind of gray, maybe a little black. But I'm just gonna keep doing this with my pencil, get the fur effect. So it's just little controlled, straight, scribbly lines. And you wanna go outside of the ovals that you drew. So it looks like it pops up. And we're just gonna keep doing this for the whole squirrel. So eventually you get him all filled in with fur. Try to keep your scribbles straight and controlled so they don't look like messy scribbles, but they look like fur. We're making fur. Get his legs. All the legs and the tail. I want to go outside the lines of the tail because we do want to be a little fluffy. All right, and there's your squirrel. See you next time.